Hello to all the gamers. We're playing Tiny Rogues. Tiny Rogues is, um, I don't know anything about this except that the reviews are good. It came out about a month ago and I was told that you should not judge a book by its cover. I was also told to turn camera shake off so you don't throw up. That sounds great. Um, two people in a row told me to play this, so we're gonna give it a try. I, I have heard on good authority it is Hades meets Enter the Gungeon with a smattering of Dark Souls elements. So, okay, I will play as the hero. He's a hot-blooded young hero on a quest to vanquish humanity's biggest adversary. Can they defeat death? He grants a red dice anytime you enter a new floor! I know what to do with that! Start with a random weapon from the tutorial after completing it. Okay, and then there's blessings that we don't have access to. Okay, fair enough. My new favorite, I'm sorry, I'm brainstorming YouTube thumbnails. Best game of 2022? Best in television game of the 21st century? Welcome, young traveler. I am here to help you get going on your journey. Move with Wazda. You can dash with space. While dashing, you're invincible to enemy attacks, but it does cost you a chevron. You can use bombs with Q. Here's some for later. Splendid, now attack the target dummy with mouse left. Show him who's boss. Get wrecked. You're a natural, let's meet in the next room. To defeat stronger foes, you will have to arm yourself. Pick up items with E, open your inventory with F. Drag and drop or right click the weapon to equip it. I'm sorry, that's a lot. E, 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 okay, and then F. And this is my equipment, okay? We got a wooden sword. I've heard of this. We've got a crude bow, and we've got an apprentice's wand. Let me just take the sword for now. Handy tip, if you want to know more details about your equipment, hold left shift. Ah, okay. I've, I've done it. Close your inventory. If you want to know even more about your current status, you can open the character panel with C. Time for a real battle. We shall meet again in the next room. Okay. WASD, you can really feel the Dark Souls influence. So true. Hold on, this is the longest range sword that's ever existed. I'm unstoppable. Hitless, any percent hitless, well done. Now bear with me for a moment. Oh, here we go. I'll take the pair, please. On your journey, you sometimes will find these things. Pears increase dex, meat increases strength, and candy improves intelligence. Food items like these will level you up and increase your power. Weapon scales, Weapon damage scales with your attributes. Additionally, attributes from levels up give you health, stamina, and mana at 10, 20, and 30 points. It is, dude, it's Elden Ring! So don't neglect attribute points you don't, that don't directly benefit your weapon. That is all I can teach you for now. The rest you will figure out on your own. Yummy. Yummy, yummy. Souls, grants a minor amount of souls. Okay, honestly get shredded. I don't fear you at all. Oh! <laughs> Sorry, that was more dramatic than it needed to be. I really shouldn't have been hit there though. Okay, minor amount of souls. We want gold or dex. Okay, we're going, whoa! Okay, obviously we're gonna go um, dex. Who cares about gold? Okay, I'm picking it up already. I mean, I'm 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 pretty good at video games for the most part. Your ass is not, by the way. Get owned. Wooden. Whoa, we're leveling. I am spinning. Choose a perk. Well, it's got vampire survivors. Gungeon meets Hades meets The Legend of Zelda. Ocarina of Time meets A Link to the Past meets Tennis for Two meets Vampire Survivors. Relentless Assault, recover stamina on hit. Colossal Might, more damage but less attack speed or 25% more damage at range. Give me the stamina. I want the stam and let's go wooden chest, chest me. You're honestly like destroyed. So I can go like this and then as soon as I hit you, I get it back with a two second cooldown, get shredded. I'm opening my chest. I've got a consumable health potion. I don't need it. Give me a key. This is the same room, you can't trick me. It wasn't even close, a key. Let me get candy for intelligence. Have you ever played the original Rogue? Can I tell you, I, I have not and there's a couple of reasons for it. One is that the shit is, um, the graphics are made of the characters on my keyboard. Um, and another one is that w with all due respect and with all disrespect, I found that I never wanted to play Rogue because people that love Rogue were so anal 
about um, the use of the word roguelite, that it just seemed like, if the game is so much fun, why aren't you playing it instead of wasting your time arguing with 16-year-olds online? So that's probably not like a fair criticism. But um, that is that is one reason. I would say it's not a reason I didn't play it, but it presented another barrier that was like, do I really want these people to, do I want to join their tribe? And I said, no. I said, uh, that honestly seems like, um, I mean, I've, I struggle enough with being annoying as is, so I don't need any help in that department. Let me go big gold. What the heck? Nothing can stop me. Scripted death? Minotaur? Whoa! You're actually like a nobody. Okay, you're actually like, I'm just gonna take a health potion real quick. I didn't know I could do that on the fly. I'm proud of myself. Guess what I'm gonna do now? I'm gonna drop a bomb on top of you. I just wanted to see what it looked like. Nice try. I'm dead. <laughs> I get killed instantly. <laughs> I don't I did see the exclamation mark, but I, I think that was a scripted death anyway. Definitely. Hold on, we're powering up our bonfire. Fire is my strength, you need my gifts. Sure. When entering a room, deal 5% more increased damage per level for four seconds. Deal 5% more bonus level if an enemy is weak to attack. Gain plus two pickup radius. 5% more damage. 5% critical hit chance against enemies moving away from you. 5% more damage against bosses. 5% increased attack speed for four seconds when you, you know what, let me get. 5% increased damage per room for 4 seconds. I'm okay with that. I'm alright with that. Okay, run it, run it back, run it back. Do I start with all of my weapons again? No, just the sword. Okay, honestly, give me some gold first. I, we don't need st- OW! <laughs> we don't need the stats early, okay? I'm not sweating the stats. Get some gold, buy some good equipment. Grant bombs or a wooden chest? I will take a wooden chest. I bet there's like some secret rooms or something, but you know what? You don't have to learn it all day one. You know, first couple of weeks, you're just on probation anyway. Bombs. Okay. Oh, you know what? Check this out. Check that out. You thought you could stop me from getting strength? Nice try. He's a genius. Wait, these animations are made with Juice FX? Did you read the review as well? I'm, I'm not pleased with the damage I took. Let's get a key. It's always nice to have a key in your back pocket. You never know what might what might come up that requires opening. Let me get a set. You know what? Let me get some more bombs. You never know. My reaction when the animations are made with code or juice FX. So true. Me giving a thumbs up on Steam in my Bill's curator group. Okay, now let's get some int. Does feel a little bit like I don't know what it's just conjuring like an image in my head right now of like a little kid in like a basement. He doesn't have a sword most of the time though. He just has like um like a little um just has like a little um like he's he's crying maybe I think is I don't know. I would love to know people's thoughts on this. You know what I like about it though? Two choices instead of four after the average room. That feels nice. I always thought like in Isaac it's just like I can never figure out which way to go. In this, it's just like, you know, don't worry about it so much. Can I tell you, I think I'm going for the pair a lot because um, it's so good in Super Auto Pets. It's going to be hard to unlearn. Random ranged weapon or accessory. Let me get an accessory. Time to feast. It's Shelob, the Cursed Spider Queen. What are you doing? What's your thing? Okay, you're shooting some spider webs. And then the, the webs are going to spawn other spiders or perhaps slow me down. I'm going to be honest with you. It doesn't seem to be the hardest boss in video game history right here. Ah! <laughs> Never mind. Don't. No, not, not right after I said it, please. Never mind. I'm okay. Yes, I'm going to feed you to my children. Ah, what the? I won the fight, though! There's a phase two?
That was so fast. Buy for 50 souls. Buy for 50 souls. Buy for, you know what? Let me get the ranger here. I'll, oh wait, I don't even have 50 souls. Never mind. I got no souls. How does that happen? Was that supposed to kill me? Like, was it, was it, I haven't, I think that was a tutorial. Tips for adventurers, seven of 10. Did you know purple projectiles will curse you? Also green projectiles inflict poison. Treasure rock drops a loot when shattered. I mean, I don't have a bomb, but maybe we'll just hit it a lot and it'll break. Nope, nope. That is not the case. Turns out you need a bomb. I could have inferred that, but you know what? It's a small price to pay to learn a, a, a lesson for life. I'll take some decks. You know what? I'll, I'll take even more decks. You don't even need like good equipment if your stats are good. That's why boxing exists. I guess they have gloves still. Now that I think about it. We don't have any bombs. We'll just go wooden chest. You don't need stats if you're good. You tell that to um, Anderson Silva. I don't know who won, Anderson Silva or Jake Paul. I did see Logan Paul hit a, a disgusting wrestling move this weekend. That was a cool gift. You decide. No, don't epic rap battles of history me. Jake Paul won. Dude, he's like undefeated. He must be the, oh, he must be the greatest boxer of all time, right? Twenty-five percent attack speed. Stacks of tipsiness are permanent, or potion effects are permanent. I'm taking attack speed for now, but this seems mighty interesting, dude. Honestly, I I should just start doing private games of Rumbleverse and then like Jake Pauling it. What does it mean to Jake Paul it? It means you choose your own opponent every time. So I could just play private games of Rumbleverse and then choose opponents who I know are worse than me and then just go freaking sicko mode every single time. Yeah, just invite a bunch of like 60 year olds. <laughs> yeah, dude, that's the ticket. Plus one, this is all, hey, health is stats, dude. So I think I should go all stats instead of just one hard, come on. Oh, but I gotta beat this guy, he's not, possible to kill he's one of the strongest enemies in, in video gaming history I am a little embarrassed that I lost to this guy last time I didn't know he had the the AOE around him I was getting a little too close that's my bad I mean we're we're cruising right now we are steamrolling. Now get ready, save, save a dash, cause you know phase two is no joke. Stand still, you make me angry. <laughs> School, oh! <laughs> Undertale? Oh, come on, come off it. I'm probably gonna die. But this shouldn't be that bad. I mean, he's like, he's so... Oh, what? It comes down so fucking fast, dude! Oh. It's damn shockwaves, man. I think I gotta play as a ranged character, but I need some damn souls first. That was the AOE? I don't need, I still, I, to, just to be honest with you, I still sort of don't understand what hit me. I thought I was far enough away, but I guess I was, I was too close to his wall AOE. What the heck is this? I've got a wand, I've got a ranged weapon? That seems like it would be mighty helpful for me, to be honest with you. It's not doing a ton of damage, but you know what? The, the safety is unparalleled. We already have a key, let me get some bombs. 
But I can really see the Elden Ring influence <laughs> when I'm using the magic. Very Miyazakian, I would say. Let me get um Let me get a key. I know what we we went decks last time. It's probably fine, but maybe we'll go treasure build. Why don't you treasure build me? No idea what these blue things are. I'm assuming they're arcana that make us stronger over time. Okay, that's too many keys. We don't need any more keys than that. What do you think these blue things are? I have no idea. Event or shrine? Dude, let me get the... Oh, those are the souls, so we can actually... No, it says plus 20% damage bottom right. I don't know, man. Enchanted bow? Yeah, pick it up. I have been expecting you, brave soul. Take th takes the, this weapon. It shall aid you on your journey. Okay, how does it compare? It's better. It's better in every conceivable way. And then let's go for some decks, dude, because we've been going decks heavy. So I guess we lose our damage buff over time, and then this re-raises it. Okay, I get it. You know what? I would love plus one intelligence, IRL. Uh, I'm definitely not losing this time. At least not to the first boss. Let me take plus one decks. What do you think plus one intelligence would represent, IRL? Is that like finishing a college class, or is that like getting a two-year degree? Um, dude, plus 20% crit chance is kind of nutty. It's one minute on Reddit. So true! That's why I have an intelligence level of five right now. Grants a ran- Okay, we want armor because we don't need a ranged weapon. I'll, I'll save my key. Okay, your ass is done. Sister, you are toasted. Look at this. It's like you're you're not even going to get to to do the thing where you like disappear for a second. Okay, you're going to get to literally do it for like a for like a millisecond. I'm going to feed you to my children. Get the fuck out of there. Your ass is highly done. This is the most powerful weapon I've ever seen in my entire life. It turns out I don't suck. Actually, it was the sword that sucks. What is this? 15% increased magic damage. Okay, I'm a little upset, but so be it. And then some souls. My god, we earned 500 souls. I thought that was the end of the game. Are you serious? This bow is magic? Wait a minute. It is! It's enchanted! Dude, we're gonna pog up! Tips for adventures. Did you know attunement means that you have to equip the item for a few rooms before its effects start working? Oh, and I did not know that. Very interesting. Okay. We got some we got some serious enemies this time. This is no joke, man. Unlike that big spider. Locked golden chest, but it can contain a varietal of awards. Well, don't let me stop you. Loving your aim assist? It's an enchanted bow. It has homing power. I wouldn't expect you to understand because you're a magicless knave. What do you have? Thorn bow. Inflicts poison. Hold on, let me take a look here. Let me take a look. So it has better scaling, but it doesn't get the magic damage buff. But it does inflict poison. Stacks up to 10 times. I'm still putting it on. I'm still putting it on. I'm still... Uh, you right-click, that's it. It does also have lower range. You're not wrong. I think it's better. Stay and have a drink or locked chest. I'm going locked chest. We don't need to get tipsy. We chose not to go boozer. Uh, I feel like the damage is actually a lot better. What do you got for me? Bombs? Random consumable that's not a potion or an infusion effect? Nah, man. Nah. We're getting a key because the, the chests that we've gotten so far have been very equipment rich. Very nice. Upgrade weapons, repair equipment. Please do. Whoops, sorry. I almost killed you. You're lucky. 
I would like to... We have zero gold. I would like to talk to you. <laughs> Don't get yourself killed. Okay. Sorry. Ranger stash! Contains stuff for ranged attackers, dude. That's me! Junji Ito voice. It was made for me. This is, it sounds fucked up to say. I bet Junji Ito is a huge fan of that new Netflix show Blockbuster about... Um, it, like a sitcom about running the last, the last blockbuster. Because anytime you read an interview with someone who makes movies that fucking suck, their taste is always incredible, and they're into like some fucked up stuff. Like they could, you know, Zack Snyder before giving interviews uh, for whatever that Las Vegas zombie movie he made, he's always like, oh yeah, this is like. Um, it's inspired by Goya and Botticelli's Cherubesque Angels in the Sistine Chapel. Then every interview with Junji Ito is like, I watched four seasons of The Office while I wrote the most horrifying stuff you've ever seen in your entire life. It's crazy. Cowboy hat. 15% increased range damage, plus it looks freaking sick, dude. Let me get plus one intelligence. Just because... I can. Always invest in yourself. That's my tip. Your network is your network. Buy items in the shop. That doesn't seem that prudent right now. Oh, come on. That's fucking. That didn't fucking hit me. I'm going to intelligence again. I would love to level up. Leveling up. I don't know if anybody else is RPG pilled like me. In RPGs, I tend to find leveling up to be very important. I am so cold and lonely. Embrace me. Hey, chat. If you weren't sold on the game before, I bet you are now. Blue attacks are ice attacks. I have or magical ice attacks that maybe they slow us down. Wait. Oh, don't be afraid of death's touch. Death is so kind to us. Are you even doing anything? Like, are you seeing how fast you're melting just to the to the mere poison damage? Whoa! I saw that come. I threw that before I walked in the damn room. Dude, this bow is incredible. Boss defeated and a phoenix pendant. Revives you from death but destroys the item. I mean, that's okay. We do need to equip it for two rooms, though. What do I have right now? Plus one heart. I mean, I, I, we need to get it attuned, okay? Let's at least get it attuned, and then we can wear it if it gets if it gets nasty. That makes sense to me. What is red dice? Yeah, I, sh I think I should use it on the next um, equipment room that has something that I don't love. That whoa! Is it throwing the damn carrots at me? Is this a joke? I'm scared. I don't want, I don't need this much vitamin A. Treasure rock drops loot when shattered. Okay, we're finally gonna get to see the value of the treasure rock. That didn't even come close to hitting me. And if you think it did, then honestly, like you need to learn something. What a shot, what a freaking shot. Okay, tinted rock gave us a key. Seems like a bit of a ripoff. The heck is this? Strong toad? Touch the golden monkey statue? Sure, why not? Plus one, plus one to all what? Plus one to all the text blocked it, man! It said plus one to all somethings and then hit C. Ah! Plus one to my proficiencies? I don't know. I have so many dice, man. Apparently dice also... Um, oh, I gotta reattune it? Okay, we should keep this on then. Um, dice reroll doors. Supposedly. But I would be totally fine just getting int for this room so that we can get a level up. Because the level up might come with a health bonus. I don't think it heals us to max, but... Ooh. What a room. I'm 
I'm pretty good at this game now. Potion effects are permanent. 25%... Okay, piercing seems fine, but 25% more damage when you have hits that inflict a status effect. <laughs> oh, man. Flat 25% damage bonus. Ooh. Oh! Okay, I'm rezzed. I'm rezzed. I didn't think that would hit me. Just to be straight up with you, I didn't think you had. I didn't think you had it in you. Um, I think we should go lock chest. But I do want to. I want to take a look here. I want to put this ring back on. It might give us a shot. Then give me golden chest. We gotta wait two rooms. Then we get one HP back. Bro, you are melted. Enjoy melting, and enjoy Mars. Piece of crap. Random infusion effect item. A lot of lads. There's a lot of lads. I am doing a ton of damage, though. There's no joke on that. Amethyst ring attuned. Crystal pine resin infuses weapons with cold for 10 rooms. We need the treasure rock. Hold on, let me take a look. I can't believe we got actual resin. You know what you do with that. I wouldn't even give myself the chance to be tempted. Certain friends in my life wouldn't be able to look me in the eye after that. Cactus Jack sent me. I would love to purchase an item in the shop. What do you got there? Random potion. Antidote potion. Plus three intelligence. Well, you know what? You can just call me Mr. Random. The heck does that mean? <laughs> Plus 10% critical hit chance? That seems okay. You disrupt nature's peace. I will stop you. Oh my god. The Tim Folan sound nightmare? Watch out, there's bear traps on the ground. <laughs> Who cares about nature's peace? You made me angry. This is now personal. Get away from me, you freaking... You, you hippie? I don't want to step in your bear trap, okay? You gotta seed the dash. Sometimes you just gotta... You just gotta seed the dash. I'm insane. I'm incredible. Quick draw belt. 20% reduced reload time. I can't see how that would be bad for us. Can I wear it? <laughs> Where does, it does it go on my amethyst ring slot? Alright, why not? Let's give it... Wait, 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 what's this though? What's this? You gotta check. You don't reload? What do you mean I don't reload? You have to reload a bow. It only shoots one arrow at a time. I mean, three int. I'm, I'm not using a dice just to use one. Three int seems like a great payout. I'm going to say don't destroy the, uh, the grave. I'm worried it's going to spawn some sort of zombie-type creature. Never mind. I'm going to destroy the grave. It's just spawning stuff at me. Okay, now here, I'm going to take this shit off, and I'm going to re-roll the rooms. One inherent maximum armor after shattering. That seems, that seems valuable to me. But I have to live. Okay, that shit is straight out of Super Mario World. I won't tell if you won't tell. Be cool, but like... That's literally the boo from Super Mario World. You cannot harm me. Okay, one permanent armor up. It seems very useful. Upgrade weapons. I have 20 gold. I think there's a chance I could upgrade. What did it upgrade? It, I enhanced the weapon. Plus one. It's B star scaling? Ooh. 
I don't really think I want a weapon. I think I'm happy with my existing weapon. Um, I'm very glad I have some armor, because uh, rooms are getting a little bit nasty with it. Nice try, nice try. A key. Let's, let's get closer to this level up. Your weapon's bad for room clear? I don't know, I seem to be doing amazing, actually. Seem to be like one of the best to ever do it. I mean, and, and this is like, I mean, this is haunted. And we're still cruising. Like two shots, this guy's toast. We just gotta wait him out. Excuse me. A little candy for me. Uh, I will take a golden chest in a heartbeat. Why do I have a, a little red and a little blue on top of my head? What's up with that? That's there's a lot of mechanics to learn. You know what it actually reminds me of more than like Gungeon is is a little bit of like at least in the the RPG elements are like Streets of Rogue. Grants three random rewards. Well, hold on. I would love a soul heart. If I use this, I'll only have two spaces remaining. Those are your little blue and red bars. Chibli, what's going on? Why are you, Chibli? It's only noon. Why are you here? You're right, I can drop my wands. I can, I can open my gift box. It was all bombs? Daylight savings, baby. But we just had daylight savings too, so didn't like, like we literally had it on Sunday. Didn't nothing change? Or am I, I must be confused. Plus one heart after shattering. I mean, that's a, that's a gimme. Daylight savings too. By the way, I've said a lot of negative things about daylight savings. I'm, I'm, I've reversed trend once more. I do hope that this is the last year we do it. I hope we go to permanent uh, daylight savings. Which would mean at some point we spring forward and never fall back. I'm going petrified, horde man. Um, but oh, that's right, we moved opposite because uh, we live in different hemispheres. That's okay. So you're moving to daylight savings, and we are moving off of daylight savings, or vice versa. Whatever, it doesn't really matter. I'll take some ambrosia, but. Um, I got to admit, when I woke up on Sunday and had had an extra hour of sleep, I felt fucking good, dude. I felt I felt real nice yesterday morning. Now, I don't know if that's worth all the other BS that comes along with it, but like, it might be close. <laughs> but then, spring forward is fucking horrible. Then it the, the chickens come home to roost for sure. I mean, this is like, you're nobody, honestly. Yeah, we should just keep falling back. Can't we just have, in October can, or November, can't we fall back an hour? And then in spring, can't we just fall back like 25 hours or something like that? Just like erase one day off the calendar? Or spring forward 23 hours instead, something like that? Surely we could spring forward 23 hours. We'd have to stop eventually. Maybe like once every 20 years, you could just have, you have like one month where you lose an hour of sleep every day. That wouldn't be so bad. Allegedly. Let's get the level, man. Forget the shrine. I want my level. And, oh, <laughs> we have a uh, B plus deck scaling now. Hello, Chibli, by the way. Good morning. Hey, Chib, you should give this game a try. It seems really up your alley. Games to play Hatsune Miku music to? It's a little bit like Cyberpunk 2077. Kind of moves to the beat of jazz. I would like to... Um, so piercing is fine, but I want just... I want to go wind wind runner. I want to dash and get attack speed. I'm going to roll on you. Key or shop? Let me get a key. I'll accept that. Okay. Um, you still got to be careful about uh, rolling into enemies. I've dodged you. I've dodged you. But the attack speed buff is pretty nice. Random infusion item. I don't even know what that is. Let's go check it out. 
Dodge, 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 dodge. Did I break it? Did I break it? Dodge, 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 dodge. Did I break it? Is the game broken? Am I about to get my first win against death? Or perhaps the first win against death ever? Infuses weapons with cold. Fuck you. I don't touch resin. I always take the chest. Resin too. Ooh, nice try! I have no dodges left. You're smoked. Dude, they stand no chance to defeat me. Like, I'm... The only thing holding me back was having a melee weapon. What do you got for me? Power gem. Raises your level by one. I mean, that. I would, I would eat that in a heartbeat. Excuse me, I don't get to choose a perk? I was promised a perk. I mean, my aim is pretty good. I, I mean, I'm a little out of practice. I didn't play any Zoms this weekend. I feel like that, that would have helped me out. But honestly, I think Zoms is great training for tiny rogues. Get smoked. Sure. Okay, I've never been. Let's go to the tavern real quick. What's up? Welcome. Can I help you to a drink? Sure. I have bought a beer. There's plenty more where that came from. Reduces by one. It's plus 8% damage. Reduces by one in 10 rooms. Lasts for 10 rooms. Okay. I'm not talking to everybody. I'll tell you that much. I'm not that happy with these rewards. I'm going to roll you. I'll take a dex. Dex is a, it's a gimme in my world. With B plus scaling, you'd be a fool not to run dex. What the hell are you doing? You're summoning like uh, little bugles? You think I'm scared of bugles? I've been eating crispy minis, man. This is an upgrade for me. I don't have a key, so I cannot get the obsidian chest. I will get a key so that this doesn't happen again. Oh! No, 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 no. By the way, Chib, are you are you continuing your Cook Serve Delicious um, campaign? Lock chest that requires you to pay one heart to open. I'm glad to hear it. I'm glad to hear it. I need to get back to it as well. Just on a Monday, cook, serve, delicious. I'm on. I think I gotta wait. That's more of like a Tuesday game for me. Pay some HP, get some HP. I don't want a random ranged weapon. Let me get a, a big bag of gold. It's the Reddit updoot arrow. The cycle of life and death continues. You do anything? He's just sort of like walking over to me. I mean, I, I'm not trying to be like an extreme hater. You're literally doing nothing. It's like fighting against a screensaver. The invincibility is like a little cheap, but you're still dead. Okay. The prophecy foretold that I shall be victorious. I don't even know what that thing is, but I, I, I can't let it live. He's invincible! Nice. Are you sure you're supposed to be like the sixth boss? You sort of seem like you're you're kind of just like a, a guy. No way, it's the Ankh from Spelunky! Dude, this game has so many references. E to go to the next floor. We in the damn waves now. Warrior stash. Contain stuff for melee fighters. Hate to see it. Hate to see it. But you know what? I'm trusting. Be me. Trusting the game. Trusting the process. Yep. Squids. AI generated green text posts. I'm not using a key for one dex. I'll take a random potion instead. Giant enemy crabs. Nice try. I mean, you just gotta be in awe of the of the sheer skill on display here. If games stayed 2D, I would be like shroud, honestly. It's when they when they took that third dimension. I just couldn't I couldn't handle it, man. I trained my brain in two dimensions. If God help us if we ever get like a fourth and a fifth dimension. And don't give me this. The, the fourth dimension is time nonsense. You know, I'm talking about like, you know, gravity or something. Nice try, nice try. 
You were good at Hades. It's pretty true. I was pretty good at Hades. Pretty good at Halo as well. Repairs one armor point. Thank you so much. Don't mind if I do. I'll, I will take a golden chest. Whoops. Got a little, got a little stun lock. Grandma took a spill down to the sand beans. Broke her coccyx. Hades is 2D? No, the third dimension is history. Torch. Melee weapons deal fire damage. Okay. Who asked? Any any askers in the chat? Turns out the fourth dimension is actually ancient Greece. It's ancient. What, you didn't phrase it in the form of a question. I mean, this is child's play right now. Is there like a hard mode or something for, for genuine gamers? I get that I'm only halfway through the run, but like, I mean, come on, are you, are you seeing it? Ooh. Yeah, it's called Melee. You know what? I'll give you a quick plus two on that one. Let me check out my golden chest real quick. As soon as I get a keys, I smoke them. I'm on a smoke key diet. You know what's weird? This is an honest question. I just it's it's um it's amusing. I hadn't really thought about it until now. You get a lot of smoked meats. You get a lot of smoked fish. You get the occasional like smoked cheese. You never see like a smoked vegetable. Thorn orbitals surround you. I would take that. Why not? Donkey, donkey. Okay, steamed broccoli, but that is not smoked. That's steamed. It's two different things. What about a smoked peach? I've never been to Heston Blumenthal's The Fat Duck. I've never had it. I've never smoked a peach. I have smoked out of an apple. And also a plastic two-liter ginger ale bottle, which probably contributed to taking, like, at least a couple of weeks off my life, long-term. Um, okay, we're rolling. I don't have a key! I'll just get a random consumable instead. Why don't people, like, smoke carrots? That seems like a, a, a vegetable that could really handle its smoke. Like, you get a nice smoky flavor on the carrot. Sweet and smoky. I mean, that... Mouth was trying uh, to come up with a new food that wasn't a gimmick. I'm telling you, smoked carrots, man. You smoke the carrot. You could use it as a side. You could use it as the basis for a soup. You could pickle it and then have a pickle smoked carrot. I don't really know where I'm going with that one. It wasn't meant to be a joke. Three bombs. And a health potion. I don't need it? Oh, because I, I have spirit hearts instead. Okay. This is a damn octopus. Tiny human. Me big, you weak. I crush you. Okay. If you say so. Awoo, guay, awoo. He should be saying, like, uh, rendezvous. I alone am the one you dome. And I keep a dome with the keeper. Hold my hand with my eyes closed. Something with the gland close. Tie me to the bed pose. I would swallow my pride. I would choke up the... You know what I'm saying? He's always talking about Glenn Close in that song. Does anyone know if this guy has any attacks? Or does he just kind of like... Is he like an NPC? Should I not be attacking him? So tiny, so weak, makes me angry. Stop hiding. So, so true. I see what's going on here. Are you like, can I hit you? Oh, there you are. Oh, I see the bars, you're gonna laugh. The bars on top of me are easy to parse visual representations of my stam, my armor, 
and my HP, so I don't have to constantly be glancing up in the in the top corner. Now I get it, and now that I can see my stam, and now it's done for me. I can see my stam fine. You know what I'm saying, Len? Anybody? It goes along very well with the Eve Six reference there. Um, now I'm like, I'm not afraid to dodge for attack speed. I mean, this is so easy. If we're talking about the best one-hit wonders of all time, I mean, Len has to at least be in the conversation, right? They gotta be in the top 25, maybe? Soul Heart Key. We go Key, for sure. Bismarcky. No disrespect to just a friend. I would take Steal My Sunshine over just a friend any day of the week. I feel like with with some disrespect, I don't think it's a bad song. Mostly because I don't want people to be mad at me. Okay, this game is getting kind of hard now. <laughs> but I feel like Just a Friend is, is a bit of a gimmick song. In the same vein as She Frickin' Hate Me by Puddle of Mud, as we talk about all the time. I would rather have Len, although I guess now that I think about it, Len is a little bit of a, it's a little gimmicky, because the guy goes, I was lying on the, he sings like uh, really raspy, he sings like little Nicky. Sunday morning of last week, armor repaired. What the heck does that mean? What the heck was that? Was my armor even, was it even affected? I don't know. Okay, can you upgrade? My thorn bow has been upgraded. Can I do it again? I'm going all in, man. You cannot upgrade your weapon beyond the current level at this type of blacksmith. Bro, what the hell? Like, you're telling me I need to go to like the big city? This is when you get like a horrible disease and they can't treat it at your small town hospital. You gotta go to like Atlanta or something? Thorn bow plus three. I mean, it still seems pretty sick. I would like to use my potion. What are you even doing here? Take me to the shrine. Things are getting a little spooky up here. They're getting a little spooky. You know, it's kind of... I'm starting to not understand how like a normal human being could... Uh, Parse all the information on the screen at any given moment here. It's no big deal or whatever. Plus one stamp. That's kind of sick. I would like to roll. I would like to take some decks. Okay, you get, it's target selection. You got enough stamp. Don't be afraid to roll. It's target selection. Take out the annoying enemies and the pounds take care of themselves. Plus, I thought that said plus eight intelligence. Let me get plus three intelligence for the cost of a mere bomb. We gotta have another perk coming soon. Okay, any enemy that shoots projectiles, which is almost all of them, your ass has gotta go. As if you messed with the fro. Okay, by the way, enjoy the thorns. I hope you're enjoying this, enjoying this thorny armor. Modifiers to movement speed also apply to attack speed. Or 30% more damage or plus one damage taken. I agree. I think potion effects are permanent. Sounds fun. Contains multiple potions! It's perfect synergy! Nope. The perfect synergy doesn't exist, cereal. Oh, baby. Okay, permanent effects. Cures poison and gives permanent poison immunity. I guess there's no reason not to drink that shit straight up. Bottoms up, brother, and the devil laughs. Increases damage by 20% for, uh, for the rest of your life. Sure, that seems pretty good. 
And then who the fuck knows? This could ruin our run. Let's give it a try. Drink it up. The hell is that? Did I just drink some, some monkey juice? <laughs> Plus one to all proficiency? What was that last one? Maybe it was something I already had. Might have been a duplicate. What's, what's up with this thing? I don't have any keys. That's fine. That's fine or whatever. I'm going, give me a soul heart. Dude, more potions. I mean, plus 20% damage forever is insane. Or seems insane. Like, the, the perk option was 30% damage, but you take double damage from all attacks. Or you take plus one damage from all attacks, which will usually be double damage, but... Plus 20% with no cost? Yeah, that seems pretty solid. I would like to reroll. I think we could do better than that. I'll take a key. Those are blazes from Minecraft. Bro, any similarity to enemies living or dead that might be owned by Nintendo or Microsoft or whatever are completely no copyright infringement intended. Please help me. I'm stuck in Zuckerberg's hellscape. Excuse me, are you, are you tweeting from the metaverse right now? Uh, this is the phoenix. The mountain's rage is my rage. There is no forgiving those who befoul the mountain. I'm literally just a guy. I just came over here. I Like Colin James, I just came back to say goodbye. Well, I bet you feel pretty silly when it's clear your ass is fucking dead. Um, I'm okay. I'm still okay. I'm still okay. I'm not even scared. No problem. Annoying little brat, everything will burn. Who do you think you are, Usher? Usher Raymond? How's the bitrate look here compared to like Vampire Survivors, for example? Hey, th these are some these are some nasty attacks. It's kind of like a it's kind of like a lot of stuff on the screen right now. Not again. I'm coming around. Focus. You don't need to cry. <laughs> Purple castle. The halls of agony. Yeah, I would like an alchemy stash for sure. We need to live though. Whoa! Here it comes. Oh, jeez. Bro, these guys are so tanky. They're so tanky. Please, I need I need the healing potions. I need relevant potions. I see a red potion. Increases attack speed by 50% like forever. That's not health, but that's pretty sick. Agility increases movement speed by 20% for forever. You do have a floor two weapon. Um, excuse me. It's been upgraded. It's been upgraded three times. <laughs> deep, 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 deep. Um, how do I heal in the tavern? Can I just buy beer? Talk to everybody. Maybe they can heal you. Okay, okay, okay. For 20 gold, we'll spend a night you'll never forget. Fully recover, shout! Let's go! Very well, I'll be right back. Let's go! What a night! Can we keep what happened last night between us? I'm sure you understand. Let's go! Dude, then absolutely I'll pay a heart to open this. And apparently I gotta get a new weapon. Everyone's making fun of me. I thought I had brimstone. Turns out it freaking sucks, dude! Get out of here, you freaking stuff. 
I'll still pay a heart to open it up. I don't, I don't care. I'm crazy like that. Why didn't you talk to anyone else? I got what I need. Lightning boots. When you dash, a nearby enemy is struck by lightning. It seems pretty good. <laughs> I need some Stam. That didn't go so... You didn't equip it? It auto-equips. Everyone's saying lol. He didn't put them on. Dash of Bitters. Darkio4719. Carl Noob. Natex Gloves. Look at that. Look at that. How do you like it? My bad? Yeah, that's fucking right. You're bad. Apology not accepted, kind of. Hold on, I need a health potion. I took that personally. Sorry, I'm, I'm Michael Jordan posting briefly. You're all dead. Dude, the dashing is actually going very well. Health potion. Three bombs! I don't want resin, so we're gonna come here. Quiver. 20% increased bow damage. Plus one heart, but it takes two rooms. Plus 10 crit chance. I mean, dude, I'm going quiver. Can I sell you some stuff? I don't need this torch. I don't need this robe. I don't need this enchanted bow. I don't need this quick drop belt. Enjoy, That's consider that on the house, okay? Go ahead, repair my equipment. Wait, our, our armor's back, dude, let's go! I'm not as dead as I thought I was. I'm not as think as you drunk I am. I'm feeling strong again. No sweat, dude. Let me get some more treasure. Seems like a very high value pickup. Trading a bomb for a key, then using that key to get a bomb later. Tarkov voice, I'm one tapped. I'm immune to poison, so like, these these little green pools don't even phase me. Souls? We need a random ranged weapon, man, just in case. I have your scent. Run. Whoa. It's pretty spooky. Yeah, I don't know about this one. Gonna do my best. Just gonna do my best. Three dashes. You see that crit? Whoa! <laughs> Two quick ones. Two quick ones. So tiny and so small, yet so quick, little rogue, the hunt has just begun. It's still. <laughs> I didn't know where to go. And sorry, I feel like we learned we learned something about that one. I mean, we're gonna get look at all this stuff we could unlock. Look at all the menus that are gonna give me option paralysis right now. Let's see what else we got. Let's get some gifts here. Start with an additional heart. That's pretty. Wait, how much do you cost to unlock? Start with five bombs. Only someone would with a wish for death would contemplate something like this. Start with 20 gold. While in inventory, you will find boss rooms one room earlier. Start with three keys. Dude, easiest purchase of my life. Let me, let me look at a couple of blessings here. Like, what do you got? This looks cool. Reduces r prices of items in shops by 10% per level. When you die, you are revived once. You can reroll traits one additional time per level. Yummy. And then let's get some characters, okay? Your armored scaling. You recover some HP. You are a warrior. 6% more attack speed per heart container. You know what? I'm buying your ass. And let's just give you a try right here. I know we got a lot left, but let's just give it a try, man. And then I'm also gonna, I'm gonna slash marker. That's gonna be Tiny Rogues 1. 